Hey, what's up? This is the last video about Yuma Digi Bison Pro on our channel Tech Brothers. We already posted unboxing, performance test, battery test and camera test videos. You can watch them by the links in description. Now I want to sum up and tell you what I like and dislike about the new Yuma Digi Rugged smartphone. Hit the like button under this video and let's get started. The main feature of Yuma Digi Bison Pro is a rugged design. The body of this smartphone is waterproof, shockproof and dustproof. The corners and rear panel are made of advanced industrial rubber. However, the side faces are metal. You know Yuma Digi Bison Pro is a rugged smartphone, but it is quite lightweight and thin compared to other rugged mobile devices. I really like the design of this phone. It's the next feature that I liked about Yuma Digi Bison Pro, and you will not find it in other mobile devices, is customizable buttons. You can press on the red physical button on the right side to open underwater camera mode, and red button on the left side to open thermometer. It is very fast and convenient. By the way, these are customizable buttons, so you can change their functions. Just go to the settings menu, smart key, and here you can assign functions to single click, double click, and a long press of the buttons. There is a triple camera and flashlight on the rear panel of Yuma Digi Bison Pro. However, we can also see infrared thermometer here. This is a new feature of most rugged smartphones in 2021. You know, the thermometer works pretty well. I have already tested the performance of Yuma Digi Bison Pro. The new smartphone has here a G80 chipset, 4 gigs of RAM, and 128 gigs of storage. You know the results in benchmark tests are not very high, about 151,000 points in end to do, but you can play any games on this smartphone. Yuma Digi Bison Pro doesn't have any problems with Genshin Impact, Call of Duty, PUBG Mobile, and other games. In addition, I like that the new Yuma Digi smartphone has NFC support. You can use this mobile device for contactless payments. To be honest, I haven't paid with credit card in a long time because I use a smartphone with Apple Pay or Android Pay for that. Yuma Digi Bison Pro has 48 megapixels main camera, and it takes very good photos. I also like the pictures on the wide-angle mode. Now, the smartphone also has 24 megapixels front camera. Now, this is good news for selfies fans. New smartphone from Yumodichi has a battery capacity of 5000 mAh and 18 w fast charging support. The screen and time of Yumodichi Bison Pro is about 9 hours and 35 minutes. The full battery charge takes about 2 hours and 32 minutes. I think it is very good for a budget smartphone. You know, the main disadvantages of Yumodichi Bison Pro are in the camera. I already told you that the new smartphone takes very good pictures during the day. However, there is a problem when taking photos at night. The street lights leave lines all over the screen. Yeah, it looks like a cool effect, but you cannot remove it. Yumodichi Bison Pro doesn't have image stabilization, so the video footage is quite shaky. It is better to use a phone gimbal, or you shouldn't move at all when you record a video. I am surprised that Yumodichi Bison Pro doesn't have ultra-wide-angle mode when shooting video. I have never seen that before. You can take wide-angle pictures, but not video. It is very strange. In general, Yuma Digi Bison Pro is a very interesting rugged smartphone, especially for its price. Only $180. Thank you for watching. By the way, soon we will get another rugged smartphone from Yuma Digi. It is already on the way. Subscribe to our channel, Tech Brothers, not to miss new videos.